Good evening, 47. Your targets are Dr. Pavel Friedel and Dr. Akane Akanawa, brilliant and unethical transplant surgeons. Both were involved in performing an operation on a billionaire's son. However, the organ had been sourced illicitly in Central Africa and the patient died of hemorrhagic fever shortly after. We have located the targets at Gamma in Hokkaido, where they are key members of staff and will enjoy a great deal of freedom of movement and protection within the facility itself. The client offers a substantial bonus if the targets are eliminated in a manner appropriate to the death of their patient. As you know, the Gamma facility has worked with infectious diseases, so you should be able to find something useful on site. And I know you appreciate poetic justice. The clock is ticking, 47. Good luck. Good afternoon, 47. I have an update for you. The Gamma facility has continued their research into the variant 2 banner coleman hemorrhagic virus and may have several samples in storage. I've been unable to ascertain the location of the samples, so you will need to locate them yourself if you wish to honor the client's special request. Good hunting, 47, as always. Hello again. It's me. I know what Dr. Fidel told you, and I'm not going to argue with that. He is a top-level surgeon. The very best. And I agree. It's a very complicated procedure. Not many people can do it. But sometimes... Maybe it's good to get another opinion if you know what I mean. That's it. No, not here. We'll meet in my private clinic in Tokyo. Much quieter. Good. You do that, madam. Probably only one yes, it's me. Maybe a little I think I just landed that filthy North, North Korea. It's one of Fidel's and patients, I'm so we're going under the radar with this one, okay? I'm hungry and they get what Call me back. And here we are, just... Yes, it's I me. I hope you're holding up all right. Do you have the material? What? No, you idiot. Do you pay attention at hey, all? Did you watch the baseball game yesterday? We're doing uh, two crazy. whole eye no, transplants. I think we have some I need you to find two identical yeah, eyes. Light blue, series. mint condition. Come to think of it, is there ever another well, keep looking. That's part of the World Series? I mean, Everywhere. Apart from America. Huh. What did I tell you Wonderful. over and right, over right. again? I hear what you're saying. I don't yeah. know, and I don't want to know. Call Never me mind. back when you have them. Yes, it's me again, madame. Just to make sure, it's perhaps better if Dr. Friedel doesn't know anything about this arrangement. Well, just don't mention my name. Yes, that's it. No, it's got nothing to do with that. It's a matter of professional pride. My assistant will contact you this afternoon. Oh, no problem. See you soon. It wasn't good. Um, <clears throat> so, Doc, uh, that enhancement treatment we discussed? Well, it's uh, kind of weird to be saying this, given the nature of my work, but I really think you should think twice about this enhancement therapy. It's all still pretty experimental. I've made up my mind about it, Doc. I gotta go big. Real big. You're young, and I have been around the block, so let me give you a bit of advice for free. Size isn't everything. In my world, it is. All the guys are getting it done. Really? I didn't know that. And they're not having any problems? I mean, performing their duties, so to speak. On the contrary, Doc. They're real beasts, all of them. Always at it, day and night. Really competing to see who's biggest. Wow. I mean, I don't judge, of course. I mean, this one time in medical school, but, I mean, I was pretty drunk, of course. You're losing me, Doc. But can you get me those steroids or not? I don't want to be the smallest guy in the room. Steroids? 
Oh, steroids. I, I thought you were talking about something else. Loosen me again, Doc. What did you think I was talking about? Uh, nothing. I I'll get you the damn steroids. Don't worry. I mean, I thought I was pretty clear, but... Well, you seem pretty fixated on guys, though, but, you know, that's just fine. This is a modern world we live in, and... Well, as far as I'm concerned, who you love is entirely up to you. Shut up. Well, there's no call for that, sir. I was just saying. Let me know when you got the meds for me. Yes, it's me. To return to that unfortunate story, I must say that it was completely blown out of proportion. Sure, the boy died and it was a big tragedy and everything, but he could have been infected before he came here. Oh, yes. I don't want to spread rumors or anything, but he was a pretty lively kid, you know? He could have picked up on one of his many so-called study trips abroad. Okay, that's fine. Call me back and we'll set everything up. Hello? Yes? Yes? No. The money should be paid directly into the account number I gave you. I can't commit to that unless it's paid into that account. Yeah, the Swiss one. I hope we're clear on that. Look, I'm doing you a favor here, okay? Of course it's legit, but if you want to jump the line, then we have to think outside the box, okay? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That's great. Let's talk later. Hello? Yes. Well, what we do is we make it a priority treatment. Normally, that's what we call the procedures we carry out on VIPs. You know, rock stars and heads of state, people like that. The thing is that when I put your name on that priority list, there are no questions asked, okay? So you don't worry about the thing. As soon as my bank guy calls and says the money's been wired into that account, we'll have you fixed up in no time. Yeah, I guarantee you that. Okay? No problem. Thanks. Yes, it's me again. Yeah, I forgot to mention that we just received something you might be interested in. Yes. Uh, they're from Egypt. No, oh, I, I know you're not specifically in need of new kidneys right at this moment, but I mean, with your lifestyle, am I right? But African is the best. You know how they can't afford medicine and junk food, so it's, it's hardly used, I mean condition. Sure. Think about it and uh, get back to me. Oh, it's good to see you. Hey, you look ten years younger already. <laughs> Listen, I was going to stop by your bed this morning, but th there was this important emergency. Yeah, yeah, a little girl got badly burned and was flown in from some shanty town. On another subject, it was a pro bono thing. Not to switch topics. Call me a romantic, but I can't just sit and do nothing, right? Anyway, I have some serious I'll come by tonight and look at the test, Mainly Scotland, okay? but... Ah, hello. I shall let you know as soon as another suite becomes available. I know you'd prefer a better view of the valley while you wait. Well, I, Ah, I there you are. So How wonderful to see you're up and walking. I'll pop by later and have a look at the look charts, at it, okay? Every yeah, that's great. Thanks. Oh, hi. How are you doing there? Oh, you look so much better now. The nurse is treating you okay? That's great. That's great. I'll talk to you later, then. This looks promising, 47. Those samples should be exactly what you need.